Okay. Um, I've just drawn a simple extruded object here, you know, using the extrude base command. We're going to try to create a fucking forming tool. Uh, okay, I'm just basically going to do what he did, I think. Uh, I don't want to get creative because I'm so disenchanted with this stupid thing. Um, okay, I'm going to go draw a sketch on the... Why the fuck would I want to do that? Um, I'm going to go draw a sketch on this plane. And, uh... Motherfucker. Okay. I'm going to simply make it like this. I'll get a little fancier with it than he did, so at least it looks different. Um, okay, exit sketch. Now I want to extrude this motherfucker out. Um, mid plane. What the f Like an arbitrary length. I don't give a shit if it's defined or not. Okay, we'll do that now. Sheet metal parts apparently hate a um, sharp corner like this, apparently. So I'm going to create a fillet, and it's important that the radius of that fillet be greater than the uh, sheet metal thickness you're intending on using it on. But, you know, to me that looks cool. 10 millimeters, that's pretty good. So now, what you got to do is you got to hide this motherfucker, and the best way to do that is uh, to go in and do an extruded cut on the face. Um, oh, uh, but no, don't do that. So go to Offset Entities, copy the face, and I guess that's. Looks like it's going to draw this thing on it. I don't know if that's a good idea or not. I don't think it is. Uh, let me undo that. <coughs> okay, offset entity. See, if I choose that, it'll have that rectangle over it. I don't think that's a great idea. Uh, I'm going to choose that instead. You know, convert entities, rather. Okay. Um, and exit sketch out of it. Exit sketch out of it. Okay, and um, through all. Voila, that makes the stupid rectangle go away in a very uncouth way. And you notice how big that is? I think that's going to cause problems, but we'll see. Um, anyway, you go into, you know, insert a sheet metal. I don't know why it's an insert, um, the forming tool, okay, you start by choosing the stopping face, which is here, and our faces to remove, let's choose that one, that one, and that one, what the fuck, um, it's got some sharp corners to it, but I'm not going to worry about it, okay, and apparently those colors do mean something, I thought they just colored them themselves, but apparently not, um, so, that's got it done, right? Okay. Um, now, I guess you go into solid bodies, you know, you choose everything, drag it over into this window, and it'll prompt you for a file name and call it Shitty Park. Okay, and that should save it in the library. So, uh, we go over to our sheet metal thing and see if we can stick it in here, and I'll bet you that interferes with shit. Nope, it actually worked. Okay, so I guess that rectangle doesn't matter. Well, no, actually, no, it actually worked. I guess it doesn't matter. So, you know, I guess I should have redefined this part when I edited it, after all. So, um, you know, I didn't bother doing that. I thought maybe you can get away with not redefining it. So, but apparently you can't, but there was no faces to remove, so I mean, I didn't know what to say about it. Um, but at any rate, now, that wasn't too painful to create it, but what's a pain, painful 
bit is actually repositioning this fucking thing. So, you know, um, it just, it's, it's easy to flip it, you know, from top to bottom, but it's not easy to reorientate it. So, that's really, 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 really fucking crude and, and very poorly thought out. <laughs>